Today, I'm going to show you how you can test the speed of an SD card. Let's go. I'll be using the USB adapter. So uh, to do this, we'll need to launch a specific little software that is called Crystal Disk Mark. So uh, we just launched this uh, Crystal Disk Mark uh, 8 right now. Shizuku edition, of course. And here we have it. Now we first need to select a proper device, which is uh, G in this case the 239 gigabyte one uh, and uh, you can test with some different speeds 64 megabytes is if you're really lazy uh, but the standard one is like uh, I think it's one gigabyte four times is the standard and that is a nice and reliable test so uh, we are just going to run this test here and uh, we're going to test read and write speed now uh, the first two uh, test values here they are sequential uh, and the two later ones, they are uh, random. And uh, sequential is basically uh, what matters the most for this case, um, which is the promised uh, read and write speed when you bought your SD card. And now the first sequential is uh, 8Q and the other sequential is 1Q, but for uh, an SD card like this, uh, it doesn't really matter very much uh, which of them you use kind of uh, the, the values will be similar but might indeed matter very much when testing the speed of hard drives which you of course can do with this application all right uh, let's just uh, run the test and uh, it will take some time to uh, complete this test and there we go all the results are in now you can see that sequential 1q 8q are quite similar um, while the random values are uh, very much different, but the random values doesn't matter uh, that much. We are looking at the sequential values. And uh, from this we can conclude that the speed of this drive is completely legit, uh, since this one should have been 100 megabytes per second or up to 100, and the write speed should have been up to 90 megabyte per second. And uh, it will never be exactly uh, the number it promised it will always be a little bit below the promised value and uh, this is absolutely legit absolutely fine 94 93 85 84 megabytes per second it's close enough to 190 megabytes per second so uh, this is uh, delivered this drive is completely legit and uh, not fake at all which is pretty nice all right, uh, it's now time to test the speed of a uh, drive, a little SD card, a micro SD card that is uh, certainly quite fake. So uh, let us indeed go here and start Crystal Disk Mark. There we go. We are now going to select the uh, proper device. Uh, and I've already formatted this to uh, the size it indeed actually is. And we're just going to perform a little quick test because, uh, well, it will certainly not be the promised values. I would be very surprised. So let's just click all and check what speeds we actually can reach. Well then, almost all the test results, now all the test results are in. And of course, we used a small size only one time, so this is not super accurate. Uh, but you can see that um, it's accurate enough for us to tell that it's no way near 100 megabytes per second uh, in uh, read and nowhere those levels at right. This one is uh, super slow, very sad SD card, which is pretty as pretty expected since you know the size is fake of it, so the read and write speeds were probably also fake. So there you go, um, pretty slow, pretty small, not worth the money. Hope this video helped you and now you know the speed of your SD card. If this video helped you, please leave a like and uh, do subscribe. This is your host, Jumadesen, signing out.